Oh my god, Reese. Yeah. Can you please do the most depressing intro for us? <laughs> <laughs> oh yes. Yes, yes, I will. Whenever you're ready. I'm waiting for this. <laughs> Thank god I need to just make sure I'm not laughing. <laughs> I've never I've never known someone to like want to get into the zone to speak absolutely depressing. <laughs> of a depressing I've never known that. Hang on. Shut up. Hello. Today, Tom and William will be doing talk in the Belgian country. I was going to join. Was that it? <laughs> was that it? I was going to go to the Tom lost it. <laughs> well, that's the intro. Also in the front row, here we come. Why you did what? Great game. There it is. Oh, Vettel's. Fair play to Vettel. No, he's up there. P3. Look at the lad, boy. Still sorry, is this? Pace, though. I'm sorry, is this? Is this our of career mode? <laughs> no one watches that shit. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Fair it's Force India one two. Again. But YouTube is so retarded that um, I never get notified or ever see when you upload. That's my intro to the race. But we're here, guys, for the Belgian Grand Prix. It's me and Williams, and also Reese is just in the party chat. Why? Because Reese does what he wants whenever he wants, however he wants. So let's do it. Yep. Hello. He's also not legal. Yeah, that too. Start not yet. yet. Not yet. He's a long way off being legal. Anyway, it's like now. the end of the year. <laughs> Williams diving up the inside and towards the south. Yeah, am I going to go side by side through a uh, route or not? Oh, I just got to uh, uh, to pull myself. Okay. What was that? He's playing the Fortnite. Uh, yeah, I am. Oh, I mean, the noise that you just made them talk. You just went, blah, blah. Uh, I basically did a Perez Ocon and uh, Palmer, I think it was, when they went three wide and I nearly got hit to the wall. Alright. Oh, wow. Well. No, it's because every time They're we both, go, really. every time we do qualifying, the grid is all messed up. Like, for example, there's a Sauber in P8. Oh, that's pretty normal. You know, like, you know. Pascal, uh, not, not Pascal, Marcus Ericsson, the, uh, the uh, money hugging stripper himself. Um, you know, he. He, he often puts the car in P8. That's why, that's why they kept him off next year. N absolutely nothing to do with the fact that his sponsors have probably threw a load of money. Yeah. That too, yeah. Just like Sergei Sorokin. Yeah, so pretty much, yeah. I mean, yeah, I mean, he, he has less money than, um, than, um, what's his name? Not, not, it's not because he's sponsored by a filthy rich world company, much. No. Yeah, definitely not. I don't think so. Definitely I mean, not too long that Kubica has to pay back the uh, money that he got from actually retiring from the sport for injury purposes. Yeah. yeah. Sport insurance. That's the word I was looking for, I just couldn't find the word. <laughs> Compensation. Basically saying you're a cripple, fuck off. I could my cripple. Um, I'm in a oh, I wouldn't okay. call Schumacher that much of a cripple. I'd call him more of a downy now. I would call him more dead. Well, Not yet. Really. <laughs> yeah, well, I know, but... I mean, he might as well be. We don't hear anything of him anymore. Yeah, I get more money off of it. More publicity. Whoa. Perez there. Doing Perez-type things. Not to count, he just scored. Well, yeah, I saw that. It's like 3-1. Three minutes How to the SpaceX I... rocket launch. Uh, maybe can. Well, it's good for Korea because they like setting things off. Yeah, Supreme, mm -hmm. Supreme Leader King of them. Supreme Leader! He's going for a move. That was risky! It worked. Oh, Con, can you move out of the way, please? You're like, you're slower than Thomas Master, the Tank Engine. Break test me, boy! Supreme Leader must make some places. I don't know why I compared Ocon to being slower than Thomas. Based on um, 
what I'm listening to. I'm not quite glad I didn't move car anymore. <laughs> uh, I mean, I mean, I'll, I'll just, I'll just oh, that's 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 you really oh, oh, Jesus Christ, Williams. hello. <laughs> Where are you going? I don't know. Well, I've got grass on my tires now, so oh my god, you almost hit me. I actually did hit you. I'm not on my screen. My screen. Oh my I'm god, oh, what is this rear end doing all of a sudden? Help, your bottom is exploding. I love it when it explodes. <laughs> right, um, I've uh, actually got a girl, so um, I'll leave you guys to it. I hope you guys crash and um, have a horrific race and um, lots of many things happen and you get elderly molested on the game. Um, fine. That's a nice outro. And there goes the continuity of this episode. In 20 minutes of light rain, bro. We've seen light rain the whole goddamn race. <laughs> Jesus, Mary, mother. Turn car, please. Oh, let the out. Missed my breaking point. Alright, can I catch Vettel before the end of the race? What's that gap? Oh wait, no, I have to look at the gap between myself and Williams, uh, not the gap. <laughs> <laughs> Great game. He's got some good pace actually. I don't think I can catch it. Not about laps anyway. I've not once been told by Jeff yet that the intermediate is the way to go, so I'm not stopping. Yeah, Jesus he's... Christ. It's all made a couple laps together, it wasn't wet enough. Yeah, it's just not wet enough at all. Well, I love this new weather system That's... done by Codemasters, where you can drive on wet and dry tyres perfectly fine when it's raining. I love that. I lost over a second in the middle sector to Vettel. It was a horrible sector. It wouldn't help that I am running quite low aero. I believe in you. Mm -hmm. Sign has always been there. But now it's awake. Yeah. It's called a Mercedes engine. Oh yeah, it's an absolute beauty. But hey, Tom, Mercedes liked you, uh... my tweet, okay? It made me happy. Just... That was like that? a life goal. You know when Mercedes tweeted out about the the they tweeted a video of them firing up the W09 engine. Oh yeah. Yeah, I quoted the tweet and I said the Merc is alive and it sounds like an absolute beauty. And I got a like off Mercedes-Benz AMG F1. And I was <gasps> so happy, okay? Maybe, maybe they watch your career when off. you're in Mercedes. Highly doubt it, honestly. But they may have clicked on my profile. It makes me happy. I'm a Mercedes avid fan. And I love it. it made me happy. So, just to end off this episode, just to end off this off this episode, we might as well start a debate in the comments. Uh, that's what. Go on then. Um, opinions on grid kids. Go. An embarrassment to Formula One. Why though? <laughs> Because, I'm sorry, but they want to get rid of grid girls because it's uh, sexist and wrong and women shouldn't be interpreted this way. So what's the benefit of getting rid of girls and putting in a bunch of kids? No. They're not just like, going to be random kids, you know. I don't give a damn if they're going to pick the kids. Whatever. That's even creepier. No, they're going to be... Kids all of a flag. No, no, they're going to be kids who are in, like, karting. Series or lower formulas. So, <laughs> like, what? Why would I? Why? Why would I stand there? And why? Why? I don't know. It, it, it's retarded. I'm sorry. It's just straight up retarded. So we must be retarded like, in football. Then. They're doing football. Yeah, it's stupid in football as well. <laughs> See the little kids walking on like they're some sort of like bar, that, like little sun or something. They ain't no sun. There's a bunch of knobs that just walk on. Literally sit, stand next to their fan bloody footballer, which is probably not their favourite footballer, you 
you've got like an Arsenal football pitch team coming on, all of a sudden, you know, you're holding hands with bloody Kashani, like, oh my god, I want to hold hands with Aubameyang! I mean, I mean, to be fair, no, uh, no Arsenal player is, is anyone's favourite player. Well, you know, my favourite player is Ozil, so suck one. And anyway, right? <laughs> is it? And then all of a sudden, you've got some... Yeah, shut up, right? And then all of a sudden, yeah, but the thing, I don't understand why they have to have some puny little faggot kids just standing there holding the bloody grid signs up. I'm sorry, I'd rather look at some fit mates. I mean, I, un like, I understand. Why would I look at some stupid little kiddies? I understand I where you're coming them, from with the. Focus. I understand where you're coming from with the, with the whole grid. To be honest, thing. they should have just done a lot better at just having an electric stand with an electric lit number that doesn't need you to have bloody stand there and hold it literally don't need anything. If you're going to say having grid girls there is wrong, and I'm sorry, putting a bunch of kids there is also wrong. <laughs> well, I mean, they could do what they do in Formula E. I don't care about Formula E, it's probably electric crap. No, what I mean is, is that they have a guy on a Segway go down the middle of, go down the middle of the grid, and then have whoever's in that car show up on the left or right. And as we can see, that's not, that's not bad, that's creative, yes. That, that's how they show their grid in Formula E. Literally just have some sort of like an electric lean, lenium, lunium, neon, that's the word, I love me a bit, neon. <laughs> some bloody neon, bloody light board that shows their number. It, it... Anyway, uh, speaking of the race, by the way, uh, North Korea on podium, just yeah. saying. Uh, Vettel wins, um, and yes. Yeah, that that was that really. It was actually quite a quiet race. I didn't really do much. Yeah, it was a straight race. <laughs> oh wow, Vettel smashed us! Look at that, one forty-seven eight. And we were in the one forty-nines. Let's yell. Max anyway, then let's have a look at the, the driver standings. This is uh, terrible in life. Kimi Raikkonen so is the one has who now did overtaken it. Williams Gaming in the championship, ladies and gentlemen. Right. He is now my closest rival. Tom. <laughs> Tom. What? Raikkonen was the one who did it. Ah, lol. Um, but level on point. Uh, Sergio Perez. <laughs> Perez is overtaking you. <laughs> oh, Perez. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so we've got uh, myself is still leading the championship now by 31 points over Perez and Williams Gaming. Vettel now in the championship home on 53 points, and Raikkonen still there as well on 56 points. Grosjean overtakes Verstappen because that's real life, and we all understand that. And then in the Constructors' Championship, Mercedes still way clear of Ferrari with 78 points clear, followed by Force India, 96 points back, and then Red Bull over 200 points back. If you guys have enjoyed today's episode, feel free to drop it a like, subscribe if you know how to as well. We'll see you guys next time. Take care, bye. <laughs>